In business development, we know the one, two, four rule. We know that if we focus on our current clients in pitching them and meeting them, it'll take us one hour of effort to get results. We know that if we focus on our ex-clients, it'll take us twice as much time and effort to get results. That's the two hours. And if we're going to chase new clients, it'll take you four hours of effort to get results. That's the one, two, four rule. Business development means you don't only focus on new clients, which are the most difficult to convert, but you can focus also on current clients, the easiest, then recontacting your ex and dormant clients and chasing the new clients as well. We can take this further. There are actually names for these three different business development strategies. Market consolidation is what you might want to begin with. Let's say you're going to spend the next quarter or the next six months where everybody is consolidating the position with current clients. We're going to do a repitching campaign. We're going to invite them to lunches, tea for two. We're going to invite them to have tea for three. We're going to cross sell to them. So for the first period, our business development is going to be a market consolidation strategy, focusing on current clients. Then for the next period, let's say the next quarter or the next six months, it's going to be a market expansion strategy. We specifically look at everybody's X clients. We can divide them into dormant and X and long X. We can measure this chronologically. The colder the relationship, the harder it's going to be to convert them. And for that period, we refocus on reconversion of X clients. Again, you can do this by proactive pitching. You can do this through cross-selling, but you want to re-stimulate those relationships. And then finally, the most difficult and also probably the most exciting business development strategy, we focus on our hit lists. We have our target lists of companies and industries and people that we want to meet, and we create the value propositions and we pitch to them. This is our market penetration strategy. Here, rather than cold pitching, approaching people who have no idea who we are by email or by call, you might want to consider using active referrals. You ask your current clients to introduce you to specific connections and colleagues that they have because you can see this on LinkedIn, because you have something interesting to offer them. You will have a lot more success in a market penetration business development strategy by using active referrals than by simply doing cold pitching. If you have any questions about this or you'd like any help with it, drop me an email to jjmcveigh at nicodonia.com and I can share some thoughts and ideas with you. Thank you.